Now coming to a beam. A beam is basically a horizontal member with certain geometry which is supported at one or two ends by supports. The purpose of these support is to hold the beam in the position even when a certain external load is acting on the beam. Now we have four different types of supports. Simple support, roller support, hinged or pin support and fixed support. First one as a simple support. For example, consider World Heritage Site Stonehenge. It is a simple support. Here, a horizontal beam is simply resting on two vertical supports which are providing the reaction forces. It is a very simple type of support where beam is simply resting on the two supports or points. Here, we have only one vertical reaction force at each support. This means if a beam is supported by a simple support, it is not allowed to move in the downward direction. Then the second type is a hinge support. The best example we can take for a hinge support is a level crossing gate or a check post gate where it opens and closes with a hinge support or another example is a door. So the check post gate is free to rotate about the hinge as we can see, but it cannot move up and down or left or right. It is fixed in that position. So this is called as hinge support where the beam cannot move either horizontally or vertically, but it can rotate. Hinge always has two reaction forces, one vertical which is VA and one horizontal which is HA. But what are these reaction forces? They are the restraints for movement of a point. Now let's move on to the third support that is roller support. The best example will be a roller skate where you can freely move around but you have a roller supporting at the bottom. The roller skate has no restriction in the horizontal direction whereas there is an equal and opposite reaction force applied at the bottom. We can represent the roller support like this. This support is very similar to simple support. It will have only one reaction force or restraint in one direction. That is a vertical reaction force. But remember your hinge support will have two reaction forces. Then at last we have another type of support called as fixed support. The best example is a beam fixed inside a pillar in all the building. It means if you consider a point in a 2D plane, it is not allowed to move up and down or not allowed to move right or left and it cannot rotate clockwise or anti-clockwise. So in this beam, you can restrict all three degrees of freedom for a particular point on the beam. Fixed support is represented like this with all the reaction forces. Those are the four types of supports. Let's recall them once again. Simple support which has a single vertical reaction force. Hinge support which has a vertical and a horizontal reaction force but no restriction for rotation. Roller support similar to simple support has only one reaction force in the vertical direction. And fixed support which restricts all degrees of freedom and has vertical, horizontal and moment reaction force. That's pretty much about the types of support. In the next video, we'll talk about the types of beams.